In today's video, we'll go over an exciting new feature added for Lumion 2024.3. I'm talking about importing lights, of course. This will give you much more control. In most instances, placing the lights in your CAD or 3D modeling program is much more precise and convenient. For now, Omni, Point or Spotlights and IES profiles are supported. But let's jump right in and see it in action. Let's start with the minimalistic interior example. So we want to add our own lighting. Let's import a new downlight. Here we have an FBX file with a model and some lights. In the importing menu, you will notice a new toggle for the lights. The brightness, color profile and cone angle will automatically import. The lights are linked to your model. If you move the model, the lights will follow along. If you delete the model, it will delete the lights as well. Imported lights can't be moved or rotated independent of the model. These changes need to be done in the CAD software. Light properties can be adjusted in Lumion, but you can always restore lights to use the imported settings. You can also detach the lights from the context menu. You also cannot delete separate imported lights, but you can disable them in the object properties panel. As of now, FBX, Collada, GLTF and DWG can support light imports in most cases. But make sure to check the documentation of your CAD software, as it depends on the exporter if the lights are going to be exported. For example, DWG files exported from Revit or 3ds Max don't export lights, but DWGs saved with AutoCAD or BricsCAD do export lights. As LiveSync does not support the light importing feature yet, if your model has lights, you will be prompted to detach them. You should note, changes to light properties are applied to all the instances of that light in your Lumion scene. If you wish to restore all imported lights of a model at once, select the imported model and use the Restore All Lights to Imported Settings option. Here, you can also delete the imported light from the model by using the Remove option. To restore even deleted lights, hold down the Control key while clicking the Restore option. That's all for this video, but far from all that's included in this update. Check out the release notes for the full details of all the goodies. As always, to stay up to date, like and subscribe below. I'll see you next time.